Lincoln's Most Conspicuous Virtue, from a Confederate General, by the Honorable John T. Morgan, U.S. Senator from Alabama. The character of Abraham Lincoln is not yet known to this generation, as it will be to those who shall live in later centuries. They will see, as we cannot yet perceive, the full maturity of his wisdom and its actual effects upon the destinies of two great races of men. Probably, he had an inadequate conception of his own work. Had he lived to full age, his guidance of the emancipation, that he decreed under military law, would have saved both races from many of the rough experiences that it has produced and will yet cause, by the effort to fuse the races into political harmony, against the mutual instinct that will keep them forever separated by race and social antagonisms. The character of Mr. Lincoln was clearly displayed in his conduct of the war, but he was deprived of the opportunity for its full development in a period of peace and security. His most conspicuous virtue, as commander-in-chief of the army and navy, was the absence of a spirit of resentment, or oppression, toward the enemy, and the self-imposed restraint under which he exercised the really absolute powers within his grasp. For this all his countrymen revere his memory, rejoice in the excellence of his fame, and those who failed in the great struggle hold him in grateful esteem. This is one of many articles that make up the book S.C.E. Lincoln A Portfolio of Portraits Leads to a Picture of Understanding.